the chef's girl here and today we're making plum cake plum cake plum it's actually an italian dessert but it doesn't have plum in it but it's called a plum cake yeah i don't know, I don't know why but it's always been called like that and it's plum cake Chef Rigo, take, us <laughs> take us through the ingredients for the very plum easy cake. very easy ingredients even for this recipe we have a plain flour a milk butter sugar eggs and here we have a sweet vanilla yogurt and the chocolate is in the freezer to get it super cold let's look at ooh, cherry rice all right chef Rigo, are you ready yeah yeah yes, yes. so let's start mixing the wet Ingredients. So we have the yogurt, the eggs. Do you crack an egg with one hand? Yes, not the next time. Okay. Let's put that up. Okay, we put the sugar. We put also a pinch of uh, salt. Did you say that okay. before? Now I forget things because okay. I never write the recipes when I cook. Mm. So we need to make sure that the eggs and the yogurt are at room temperature. So you, when you're weighing the yogurt, just set it aside for 20 minutes before you start to add the butter. Because if you add the butter in, the butter will go hard and it's not going to mix nicely. Okay. Okay. That's it. Let me get some more. Needs chocolate. Now that the mix is ready, we can use this as a base and add whatever flavor we want. Okay, in this case, we're gonna put that chocolate. Sorry, Pupa. If you want, you can put coconut, you can put uh, berries, uh, you can put whatever you like. White chocolate. Don't eat the part of the... Let's see how this thing is going to come out. I've never done it with this uh, chocolate stripe. Plum cake mold. <laughs> Ready? And we're just going to put it in here. Some little paper. So, that amount. It's gonna be fine for a plum cake shape uh, 20 centimeters times 7. Does this make sense? Yeah. 20 by 7 centimeters. Now we sprinkle it with uh, some custard sugar on top. Is that so it caramelizes? Yes. Awesome. <laughs> I think that's enough. Like I said, no exercise and the gym's closed. Chef Rigo is covering his scraper in sunflower oil because. So it doesn't stick when I cut it. It's gonna do like that, very quickly, like that. Get it off. Why? Because uh, after we cook it, it makes the classic, everyone knows, blue cake shape. Beautiful. So, so now we're gonna put it in the oven, 180 degrees for 20 minutes. Yeah. And after other 20 minutes, and 160. Alrighty. You set the timer. Beautiful. What are you doing, Michaela? Cleaning. The time has passed and we can now reduce the heat of the oven. Should we check it? Wow, it's looking good. Alrighty, Chef Vigo, the remaining 20 minutes have passed. Let's check out this plum cake. Plum cake. Plum, plum cake. There we go. You can see the cut on the top from the scraper before. Amazing. So you're gonna cut it up and give me a slice now? No. It's yep. breakfast for tomorrow. No, I was trying to. This is just a sample. This one sample. You have to wait. I think we should have a sample. Always when you cook a cake, you should wait that it cools down before cutting it and eating it. But she can't wait a second. She's always going to do like that. Yeah, there's no time to waste. All right, let's put some ice and sugar and serve it. Yeah. I'm not just gonna put this piece like that. Just because I want to be. 
passé. Wow. Very simple, quick and easy. If you just want to make up a little treat for yourself in the afternoon, pour. Oh, there's the cherry ripe. Love it. So that's how you make a quick and easy plum cake. Plum cake, I'm already in <laughs> Plum cake. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. Follow us on Instagram, The Chef's Girl, so you can watch all of our cooking videos.